Everybody Damn, it's cold there. <laughs> it ain't just us, man. <laughs> hey, Tommy, um, obviously free agency played out pretty long for you. Did you anticipate always coming back to Detroit just a matter of when and when it would get done? Um, yeah, definitely. Um, free agency was a it was a great process. Uh, I'm happy to be back and just get this thing going and looking forward to doing great things in the city for sure. For you, what was the, the you know, coming up the last season, you, you arrived here right before the trade deadline. Uh, you know, you got a, a strong 20 game stretch up the ball. Well, how do you build on that and what's sort of your focus going into next season as far as growing up? Uh, just trying to get better each and every day. Uh, I feel like I try to live my, my life on every day trying to get better at something and every day trying to attack every day with an agenda. So no matter what it is, no matter what it is in life, just trying to be a better person, a better player. So my goal for this season is just to be a better person, better player, and just try to help this team do great things. Yeah, definitely. I feel like it was definitely, uh, when I got traded, it was definitely different at first. But having Troy Weaver with me uh, made it much easier because um, he was with me in Oklahoma. He was a big part of why they, they drafted me as well, to my knowledge. But uh, having, with, having him with me made the process so much easier for me. And it made me feel like I was at home since day one I've been here. So for me going into this year, uh, with whatever is asked of me, whatever is asking me from the coaching staff, just try to go out there and just try to be myself for the most part. When you look at this roster, what, what excites you about the new pieces that we're adding? Obviously, Cade and, and Luca and a couple other guys. But just keeping most of the same roster intact from last year and adding those pieces. Uh, what excites me the most is uh, definitely we got a great group of young guys coming in. Uh, we got Kelly that came in as well and Corey Joseph that came back as well. Um, what excites me the most is just being able to play with these guys that all love the game and that all want to win for the city. I feel like when we're in practice, when we're in workouts on a day-to-day -day basis, you see how much this means to everybody and you see how much work is being put in. It's like you feel like you fit in and you feel like you want to be around that. So I feel like that's what's most exciting for, exciting for me. And not trying to look too down the road, not trying, to, not trying to just be always thinking about the future, 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 just trying to live in the moment. Uh, I feel like that's very big for us living in the moment because we got to take this thing one day at a time and we can't take nothing for granted. Dwayne said, Troy said, Dwayne emphasized that a couple of players have talked about it, that this has to be a defense first team. I know that's always been kind of like the backbone of your game. You came in as known as a, known as a guy who would be a defensive stopper. You see this as a, as a real fit for you in that, and, and the, the fact that they're emphasizing the defense presents you with a real opportunity. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I feel like you gotta in this game of basketball, you gotta play both sides of the game. So, uh, coach emphasizing defense and Troy emphasizing defense. I feel like that's something that we could be really good at, and that's something that I feel like I could be really good at. And I'm just gonna keep trying to get better at it and keep trying to take on those tasks. I mean, those are big tasks. Those are big shoes to fill. But just keep trying to take on those tasks and keep trying to be the person that I know I can be, and just keep getting better. Appreciate you guys.